Perf Pro tip of the day here, again with Director of Coaching, Jason Schista, who's responsible for a lot of the workouts we do here at Vision Quest. And one of the things he looks at is IF, the intensity factor of the workout. This is a lot like TSS where it's relative to everybody. So if everybody's doing the same relative intensity, they should have the same IF. Um, if they're doing an interval at 90% of threshold, they're gonna have an IF of that interval of 0.90. And why is that? Intensity factor is the ratio of your average power for a given duration, or actually your normalized power, to your threshold power. It's a very simple percentage. So you'll see a number of point something equals 60% or 70% or so on. A typical submax ride might be between 0.6 and 0.7. Uh, a tempo ride would be 0.7 to 0.8, something like that. Threshold would be 0.9 or, or even up to a point, a 1.0. Uh, you can't really go too much harder than that for longer efforts because you're going to sort of hit the limits of threshold power. Uh, most of our VQ workouts will be somewhere between 0.8 and 0.9, depending on the makeup of the different workouts that they can, or different intervals that they contain. So guys, think about this. Intensity factor is how hard something is. Basically, if it's really hard, it's going to be 0.9 and above. If it's really easy, it's going to be under 0.6. And think about it, just add a percentage to it. If it says eight or 0.8, it's 80% difficult compared to your threshold power. So you're never gonna have an intensity factor for over an hour that's gonna be over one because it simply can't happen because your threshold for an hour is a one on the intensity factor. But understand, it's a great way to quantify how difficult something is. Come, sometimes you do a four hour ride, your intensity factor is 0.8, that is a really hard ride. You spend a lot of time at tempo or above to have that sort of intensity factor. If you're trying to keep yourself in that aerobic zone and you're doing long rides, the intensity factor shouldn't be over 0.75. So go ahead and make sure you're looking at it when you're looking at the screen. It's called IF, it stands for intensity factor, and it's all based around percentage of threshold.